everyone, it's Hermione. Today I'm gonna be doing a thrift haul or a charity shop haul, whatever you wanna call it, as I have a ton of stuff littered around me. Anyway, let's start by, I'm gonna show you guys what I got when I was in the States. The first thing I picked up in a Goodwill store is this cap, and as you can see, it looks just like the Brandy Melville caps. It's got the little alien patch on the front and it's black, it's a baseball cap. On the back, it says alienware.com, which is how I know it's not Brandy Melville. This goes to show how long it's been since I've done a thrift haul because I I was in the States in March. Now it is May, so that's pretty bad. Sorry. But it's collective, so yeah. In another store, I picked up these shorts. These are originally Aeropostale shorts, and I picked them up, I believe, for about $2.99. And they're just like a tribal print pattern. They're black and white, they're flowy, they're really nice on. They kind of look like a skirt, but they are shorts so you know no gust of wind is gonna expose me in the same store i picked up this shirt this is just a plain purple shirt and it's just got little lines all across it but it's just you know textured looking and it's purple and i wear this non-stop all the time it's just really really comfy and it goes with anything if I want to wear a little pop of color and then I went into another thrift store it wasn't a goodwill I think it's just a local thrift store and I found this this was like 79 cents and it's just a striped turtleneck t-shirt and I saw a lot of these like primary color striped t-shirts with the turtlenecks in H&M and other stores and I thought picking one up for 79 cents is pretty good that's all I can find for America America, but when I came back here, I went to my old university town, which is a pretty big city and it's got tons of students, so they have some pretty nice stuff in the charity shops. So I went a little bit nuts and I found some good stuff. The first thing I'm going to show you from these stores are these shorts, which are from Cotton On, and I believe we don't have Cotton On in England. They're really high waisted, very stretchy, kind of 70s inspired, and they are a little bit cheeky but they're really comfy. I found this Topshop shirt and this was five pounds because it was brand new with the tags on and it's got this gorgeous detailing all over the front. It's got little beads in circular flowery shaped patterns and it's so so pretty. It's spaghetti strap so it's really nice in the summer. I rarely wear like beads and sequins in the summer so I think this will be nice in my summer wardrobe. This dress is in the same shop. It's a little bit jingly so I'm sorry. It's covered in beads. It's originally from Forever 21 and it's just a white dress. This cost me six pounds but it was brand new once again with tags on it. I guess it must have come out pretty recently because it's got a high neck but I'm really really excited to wear this in the summer. Next up I have this white crochet top and it looks like this. It's cropped and it's made out of kind of a stretchy elastic knit. It doesn't look like fabric it's just kind of like lots of thin threads. I love it. It was three pounds and I think it must be vintage. It doesn't have tags in it and it doesn't look like anything you would find on the high street at the moment. It's very good quality as well so I'm happy with it. Now really quickly onto some things I found when I was in London and London if you go to the right areas has the best charity shops. The first thing is this scarf and it was brand new with tags. Just a pink and white striped scarf that looks like this. That was five pounds but it is London and it was new with tags so I didn't hate paying five pounds too much. <laughs> I came away with this denim Topshop skirt. It's striped and you guys know me, I love stripe and it's just kind of a little bit A-line but it's also quite tight and it's got pockets. I love skirts with pockets. I love them so much. I love this a lot and I can't wait to wear it non-stop this summer. I found this cute River Island crop top. It's lime green. I went through this phase where I loved this color and I wore loads of this color. Kind of out of that phase right now, but I couldn't resist picking this up because it's nice and thin and it will be nice in the summer because it's cropped and I thought it would go really nice with this. <gasps> This video is all over the place, but I forgot that I actually got this in America. I was like, where did I get that? It's from America, okay. And it's soft, it's a jersey, like sweater fabric, but it's really light as well. So it's gonna be perfect in the summer. Once again, it's got pockets and it's got stripes. So it checks all of my boxes. I love this kind of stuff. And I just loved how soft 
it was so I couldn't not get it. It's by a brand called Lou and Grey which I've never heard of before so maybe it's like from Urban Outfitters or something, I don't know. So there is that and I'm so happy I found that one. Right, so back to England and to my hometown where I said I never find anything. I found a ton of stuff the other day. <laughs> So first things first, I found this Topshop dress. It was three pounds. It's Topshop Petite, so it's a little tiny bit short, but it's really cute and it's got stripes on it and it's got the ring around the neck. And then it goes into a denim skirt and it's so sweet and flattering. Just the way it falls is really nice. It's a little bit like a t-shirt dress, but it does come in at the waist. It is perfect. And I can wear this around the house. I can wear this going out. I can dress it up. I can dress it down. This this is the exact kind of thing I like to throw on in the middle of the summer. And then in the local hospice shop, I found another Topshop dress. So it is this dress. It is stripy. It's kind of like a beachy looking dress. It's a shift dress cut at the front, but then it goes into a tight waist and it flares out a little bit. It's got a nice invisible zipper on the side and it's the colors that I really like about this. The orange and the teal blue color make this feel so beachy and because it's a canvas dress, it just feels like the perfect beach dress that you can wear into the evening as well. I found this denim jacket, but it's not just a normal denim jacket. It's like a moto style leather jacket cut, but it's denim. I think that's really cool. I don't know, maybe it's really 90s and you're gonna be like, that is so hideous. But I really like it. It's very thick and it's cropped as well, so it's perfect. And it's by a brand called Pumpkin Patch, which I've never heard of before. It's got the nice denim buttons on it and it's got a zipper. And I'm very pleased with this because I've been wearing it a lot recently and it's just the perfect lightweight coat. Um, Now I'm going to refold and rehang all of these clothes which I'm really looking forward to. I hope you guys like this thrift haul. Let me know if you do. I just really want to encourage you guys to look in charity shops, look for secondhand things, thrift stores, op shops, whatever. Also, if you want to see more thrift hauls, I'm thinking of maybe putting them on my vlog channel. What? It's kind of been sneakily hidden on the sidebar of my channel and in the description of my videos. I didn't want to make a big thing about it because I didn't want to like commit to it, but I do want to vlog throughout the summer because Ben and I are going to do some really cool stuff. We made a little fun montage of being in the Outer Banks. If you want to see that, I will link that in the top line of the description so you can go and check that out because I had a lot of fun making that. Um, so I want to do some vlogging, but maybe that way I can do hauls on my vlog channel because they're more chat. So let me know if you like that idea and don't forget to check out my vlog channel I only have two videos right now, but check it out. It will be listed down below Anyway, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. It's been so long since I've done one of these Let me know where you would like to see these on my main channel or my vlog channel Let me know down below and if you haven't already don't forget to subscribe if you've got this far like props to you I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you next time. Bye